Welcome to Pop Turnative, where we dive into topical discussions from the worlds of pop culture, social media, and sports. Here is your host, Peter Romoliotis, aka PD Beats. PD Beats here from Pop Turnative, speaking to Yvette Nicole Brown about season two of Big Shot premiering on Disney Plus October 12th. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you for having me. Uh, you know, this is something you can kind of answer based on season one as well. But does it sometimes feel like you're working on two shows where it's about sports and basketball, the other <laughs> side of things that's not about that at all? Absolutely. You know, first of all, it's it's fun to get to show the the serious side of Sherilyn when she's an administrator and then get to see the playful side of her when she's with uh, Holly and Marvin. So that also has a duality to it that feels like two shows, a, a comedy and a drama sometimes. Is there a specific mindset when you're announced that you're coming back for season two? Are you focused more on kind of seeing what your character is up to, just in general, seeing where the story goes? Like, what's the specific mindset when you know you're coming back for another season? I'm always so shocked when I get a, a second season of anything because I had a quite quite a few runs of one and done or one and a half done. So I don't have any expectations ex- aside from, wow, I get to keep working with these great people. So that's what I came in with, just the, the joy of trying to enjoy every day. And this season we shot on the Disney lot. So I got to go to work every day on the Disney lot in Burbank, which was exciting. So it was just me enjoying the experience more so than feeling any pressure about what it needed to be. Because I know that we have great writers and great actors and great directors. So I knew that the product was going to be good no matter what. You've been Nicole Brown as a storyteller. That's what you do. Is your favorite <laughs> thing about being a storyteller the fact that you get to dive into these worlds of big shock, community crossing swords? Is that the best part about it? Yeah, it's great to get to be other people for a minute and get to, to see how other people live. I... I always try to make every character I play uniquely uh, her own person. And so I get to kind of walk in the shoes of someone. And Cheryl Lynn is doing very well in life. She's got a beautiful house and a great family. So it's really fun to kind of walk in her shoes uh, every season that we get to do it. So, yeah. Is it cool to be a character who's like in the middle of like the school and the like the sports? Like I always thought that was a really cool thing because, you know, the the girls are playing you know at a high level but they also have school so your character is like really in the middle of that you know with john's character have you thought about that at all yeah it's a lot of fun this is the thing though i yvette know very little about sports so i don't even get to really enjoy the experience of the games and stuff because i don't really know what's going on so for me (laughs) it's more like I, i like more the administrative side of things than sitting there trying to pretend like i understand why everybody just got up and screamed because something happened because i don't know why they screaming Certain characters in season one, their arcs would change and grow immensely after episode, like after one episode. Do you Mm -hmm. notice that in scripts? Like at all? Like, do you notice that? Or is it only when you go and shoot it that you kind of notice these arcs? You know, I think it's probably when you, well, you definitely as an actor, you should know what your arc is. You should have had a conversation to know. So you're playing the right beats. But yeah, when when you're with other people, you have to watch it. Because also when they're shooting, a lot of times, if I'm not in the scene, I'm not on set that day. So I don't even get to see what they're doing or how it's affecting them. And when you have, you know, actors that are as great as 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 Sophia, who plays Emma, I am I call her baby Meryl Streep. I never know what she's going to do. So when I watch the show and there's an emotional scene with her and John, I'm always blown away. So you got to wait to see it. At least I do. What are you hoping they get out of it when they watch season two of Big Shot, takeaway wise this season? Uh, I hope they understand they, they get the understanding that's that women in sports are formidable. I hope they get the understanding that women coaches are formidable and deserve just as much respect as the men do. And I hope they 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 can gather together as a family and and have conversations after the episode or after the complete binge about what they learned about themselves and about their journey as parents or or kids or students. Um, after watching our girls go through their journey this season. Season two of Big Shot premiering on Disney Plus October 12th. Thank you so much for your time. It was so great chatting with you. Thanks, Petey. Thank you for tuning in to Pop Turnative. Make sure to check out our past episodes of Pop Turnative on YouTube. Be sure to like Pop Turnative on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. This has been an Autograph Communications production.